Richmond that wants you to expound and talk a little bit about gout in the feet. Oh, I just did a cartoon on gout on my AI app. It's so cute. Nice. <laughs> if you search my page, search gout. So gout is an infl inflammation. It's a form of arthritis. So basically in gout patients, they can't break down uh, purines, <laughs> right, which are proteins. So when their body breaks down proteins, they create too much, pu too many purines which are uric acid crystals. Those crystals like to hang out in your most distal joints. So they like to hang out in your big toe joints, your hands, your ele elbows. They like cool places, but their most favorite place to hang out is your big toe joints in your, in your feet. So you'll present with a red, hot, swollen foot. It's usually a male, probably in their 50s and up. If it's a woman, it's usually a postmenopausal woman. Um, and then they usually can always remember something they ate that precipitated this gout attack. Like they went, it was the holidays, they ate a lot of protein. Maybe they drank some beer, drank some wine. But they can always, when you ask them and you show them the list of foods that cause gout attacks, they're like, oh yeah, I had a couple glasses of red wine, then I had... Oh, I had some steak. <laughs> so don't so, tell me. We do it to ourselves. Yes. But okay. usually, so then once I see a patient that I'm suspicious of gout, first thing I'm going to do is x-rays. Then I'm going to order blood work. I'm ordering a uric acid level. And I'm also ordering kidney function because that can also affect your ability to excrete uh, uric acid. So I'm looking at your uric acid levels. So if you're elevated, that tells me you have gout. Then we have to start you on gout medication, and then I give you the gout diet. So basically, depending on your level of goutiness, I guess, depends on if you can take the gout medicine at, with a tax, or you have to take it every day. And then some people get gouty tophi, which are like hard masses, like rocks under your skin, mm -hmm. and they big lumps. If you ever Google gouty tophi, you can see what they look like. They're hard masses. And you'll see them like on people's hands, on their elbows, their knees. You can get gout in your eye, your vessels. It can it can deposit anywhere in the human body, but it really likes its favorite place to go is your great toe joints and your feet. Thank you.